Yo there guys, what is happening? Welcome back to another video here on Nasha Vlogs. You may remember back in March I did a video about uh, the coronavirus and the UK theme parks. Since then quite a lot of people have done videos as well. I just want to sort of give an update because scientists linked to the government today have released a sort of traffic light system on ending lockdown. So I'm going to go through that and I'm also going to give you a potential predict my own prediction on when I think we're going to see the parks reopening. Red phase, which is a partial lift of lockdown, which means small essential shops can reopen, warehouses can wear reopen, sorry, hairdressers, hairdressers can reopen, nurseries can reopen, however travel should still be discouraged. Now, this red phase is apparently going to start on May 11th. Now, on to Amber, which is extending freedom. So, when the Amber system kicks in, it means small businesses with up to 50 staff can reopen. Some social distancing measures will be lifted. Schools will reopen. Restaurants will open, but with strict seating, I think, rules. However, wearing masks will become compulsory on public transport. Now, this is apparently going to happen on May 25th. And the one everyone's looking forward to is Green Phase, which is wider freedom, which is weddings and funerals can take place with larger groups. Cinemas, theatres, comedy clubs and sports venues can reopen. Pubs can reopen with restrictions. Wearing of masks still compulsory on public transport. And gyms can reopen but must ensure enhanced sanitation. Now, that green phase is going to happen on June 15th, apparently. And now, the important question when do I think the theme parks are going to reopen? Personally, early July, I think. I know I did put on social media that I was being optimistic, saying potentially May half term. But I don't think, I don't think so. We're not going to see. I may have to. I mean, we're gonna, we're definitely gonna see a summer holiday opening, but I don't think it'll be any earlier than that. So that means us who go to Fort Park and Alton Towers, we're gonna get a very short season. We're gonna get four to six months, if that. Um, and potentially certain new additions for this year at all UK theme parks are. I will not be surprised if they're delayed further than this year. Uh, obviously. Pons Park is due to open Tornado Springs at the end of May. Potentially, I don't think we're going to see that open, open until July, maybe August. Um, Black Mirror at Fort Park, that will just open with the park. Flamingo Land's 10 Looping Coaster, I personally don't think it's going to open until 2021. And yeah, you know, it's a shame this had that to happen, but we're, we're, we're getting there we're getting there. Anyway, that's all I wanted to say. Yeah, comment below your thoughts. Do you think we'll see a July opening or do you think we might even see a later one? I know some people are saying, oh, we should just, the parks should be closed till next year, but you got to think, parks like Funland Hailing Island, they can't afford to wait till next year because they will end up closing permanently and all them rides will get sold off somewhere else. Alright, anyway, thanks very much for watching, I'll see you in the next one, peace out.